really nice to know that there are so many initiatives coming up, especially in the field of media. So as you are representing India uh, from the Ministry of Information and Broadcast, what's your opinion about uh, the entire event like Media Global, uh, which probably becomes a platform for a lot of organization? Actually, this uh, World Media Congress, which Abu Dhabi is organizing, this is the first World Media Congress and I am here to see it also because we in our country also want to hold a media and entertainment summit sometime next year. Our Prime Minister has directed that we should be holding a global media entertainment summit on the lines of Davos, like Davos is for manufacturing and uh, for uh, industry. We should have a global media entertainment summit. Uh, so this gives us uh, an idea of how to go about it and uh, what are the areas, what are the concerns of the world and what are the topics which we should be uh, uh, talking about apart from uh, showcasing what India is doing in the media and entertainment sector. Wonderful. Uh, as media professors and students, we are really excited to be part of that event as well. And now being from the ministry, what do you think is the future of media? Media, the traditional media, and uh, as you could uh, would be seeing and you would have seen in the sessions and other places, because now everybody is talking about the role of social media and the new media which is coming in. New media is a very fast way in which the uh, news is getting disseminated, information is getting disseminated, and the youth of the not only our country but the entire world is moving away from the traditional media. The newspaper reading habits are dying down. It is only confined to a certain age, so. But social media also presents its own challenge because when we talk of news, uh, the traditional media, then there is a number of levels through which the information passes before it is actually put out in the public domain. There are checks and counter checks and uh, the pressure of being the first to be out with the news is not there while this uh, while in the new media, it is always a breaking and whether you are the first by one second or a millisecond. So <coughs> those pressures I think uh, lead to a lot of information, misinformation or uh, sometimes under the garbage, under the garb of that uh, being fast, a lot of false information being out in public domain and people don't know what to believe in. Many a times they get misguided. So that is a regulatory challenge as well as a challenge for the media itself because it is for the media to convince the people so that uh, they don't lose their credibility. Thank you so much, sir, for your time. We wish all the best to the Ministry of Information and Broadcast.